crap. My phone is slow. It told me that I'm. It still has even said. There we go. Alright, for you guys watching, we're just going to do some fishing since we don't have league today. And I figured we could go to Russia because obviously I haven't really been here much other than for the Vogus Ander. How's it going, John? And we're going to do some spotting, which I haven't done in a while, so I will be pumped about that. Let's see. Oh, Monkey Goby. I need to catch a few of them, actually. How's it going, country? Got my other account 36 today. Okay. Yeah, I, I'm, I only uh, use one account. Alright. I think you're playing on the phone, too, or something, right? Alright, let's start spotting. Ian, have you been doing any comps lately, even? Um, someone... What was it? I think I won one the other day, actually. Um, Midnight Salmon, yeah. Um, Midnight Chinook got one there. Oh, nice. Mm. Yeah, 76 something I've got, yeah. Dang. Was that your PB? Oh, no, no, no. I had a 77 there, yeah. Oh, that's right. That 77 one, I think it was, wasn't it? Man, it seems like a lot of monsters are coming out of that thing lately. Oh. Well, it seems to be in the second spot as well. That's why I keep catching them there. The big ones? Uh, yeah, the long walk down there. Yeah. We've uh, we've been having... Uh, uh, out of the whole group, we've had, have been having them at every spot. Even I even seen one come out of the middle again. Somebody was fishing the middle like the old days. Hmm. I got one. I have a, the biggest mark I have, I think, is the one uh, up at, uh, from the top. Uh, one of my friends caught it up there. I can't remember which one anymore, but, because everybody's had a few of them big ones lately. I actually have it. What am I spotting for? Anything. So we're going to be throwing out a bunch of different poles, John. How's it going, Maxie? Yeah, trust me, I, I'm happy I'm feeling better, too. <laughs> that was rough. There's some there's some real bad stories I'll be able to tell for a long time that we'll all laugh at, but not right now. I'm spotting out too far, but I don't mind. How's it going, Fur? So what comp, comps right now are not on rotation, Ian? Again, sorry, what's up, buddy? What comps are not on rotation right now? You know, because there's always some that are off for a while. Um, I haven't seen the no one on there for a while. Yeah, I was just going to say that, too. I haven't seen that one for a while. No, Emperor. There's a few yeah. others that trying to think of offhand now, but I don't think I've seen Living Fossil for a while either. I could be wrong on that one. Oh, is it tomorrow? You've been a lot of amateur ones on there, haven't they? Yeah, I was going to say, every time I've been looking, is uh, mm. not much, or not spotted much on that lake. What's the best spot? Right here. Uh, we'll see if we have good luck or not. Oh, man, and I did it at 5 a.m. like an idiot. Ah, I remember to fast-forward time, because I think this is a midday peak, but we'll see what comes out. Damn it. Let's see. Yeah, we'll just we'll roll with it.
It feels like there's an obvious one, though, that isn't going on right now. I know triple trout slowed down. There hasn't been many of them. Actually, <laughs> same with Salmon Clash. There's only been like one a week, you know. Mm-hmm. I forget to change all of the... Oh, yeah, yeah. That's something I do a lot too, John. I forget to change the time. 32 of 49 fish on the other one. Oh, nice. Yeah, I've just been taking it slow. I haven't... Outside of the Volga Xander... For you guys watching, I haven't went really to any lakes and tried fishing them. So I've been just doing uh, my videos and going from there. How's it going, Dio? This morning I thought it, well, I stepped on my headset and I thought I broke it. it slipped down on the side of the bed. Cracked and everything. Got the musky lure. Yeah, that's a good one. Don't lose it. This sounds really stupid, Ian, but I have one spot open on my backpack, and I'm trying to figure out what I should put in there. <laughs> it's been like a week. You're like, I don't know. <laughs> I, I'm sure as soon as a new lake will come out, it'll be like, ah, I need more spots again. Is there one you out lately or not? Uh, what's that? When's the next one coming out? I don't know. I keep hearing rumors of two months, but I don't know. I haven't heard from anybody really reliable, so. Actually, good thing you asked that, because I'm sure it's going to get a million of them questions today, actually, because I didn't talk about it today in the news video. Vampire mouse. Yeah, it, yeah, it doesn't work too bad. I use the spinner all the time for the muskies. I can show you what I use in my bag here. Give me a second. I use, uh, oh, not that one. I use that one for the muskies. They really like that. Man, I got a funny feeling I'm not going to get a lot on the spot because of how bad I spotted and <laughs> right away in the morning. Let's see. Get a couple unique, so be happy. Yeah, I have the vampire one as well. Do you guys, what was the vampire mouse lure from? Was it from a mission? Oh, yeah, the Takan one, wasn't it? The, um, oh, the tiger, was it the tiger fish one? Is it that one? Or not? That was a that was a duck lure, I think. Oh. I think the vampire mouse, I think, was the con. I have to look. Actually, I could just look right now. Monster fish. Organized chaos. Yeah. That's the way mine is. Um, mastering. Not that one. Monster fish. Yeah. From where? Halloween. Oh, was it? Oh, okay. Oh, got you. So what is the one we got? Oh, it's a water vole. That's the one we got. Yeah. The water vole, I haven't really used after I got, or I haven't used it at all recently. To be honest, they used to be the hell or the monster fish monster lures used to be like some of the best in the game, like even the turtle spoon and the, and some of them, you know. But now I just don't use them much. Boy, this spotting is terrible. I'm not even getting close. I 
Let's go on tricks. Oh, you're on lunch break? Oh, nice. Actually, when I'm done with the stream, I'm going to eat too. Ah, last one. Do you have some fish fried up for me? <laughs> no, I think the wife is going to make fajitas. She's home today because of a snowstorm. Get snow again, huh? Yeah, well, it's kind of a weird one. It's not a lot of it, but we got a bunch of rain and it's freezing, and then um, that's what's going on. Actually, I think I could probably send a picture for you guys here. Um. And then my driveway is pretty steep, too. Come on, get that thing off my screen so I can... Oh, okay, there we go. Um, let's send it this way, then. <laughs> well, this was a little bit ago now. It's starting to actually get a lot worse, but... For ice, anyway, not snow. It's only supposed to be a few inches of snow, so. Let's go on, Party Razor. That's the cold. Oh, uh, just the fact that it rained and then froze up. Mm. Oh, maybe it's a slow day. <laughs> uh, that was just a common dream. This is not going to be big, whatever this. Use mayflies on the other poles. I, well, I'm not going for hydrate now. Or, uh, oh, there's a yarn. We needed that one. Um, I think with the eyed, I'll just, the eyed and, uh, God damn it, what's the other one? I like mayflies here. I have to look. marked out yeah the job of the zeke and the, the zeke can catch them on two in the eye but i gotta get all the breams first and the roaches and could be dumb and try to get an asp quick. Probably should use a heavier one, but this will work. How's fishing going? We just started, so don't know yet. I'm on the wrong time frame, but I'm not too worried about it. You can really tell because normally these poles are going off here at Russia really quick when you spot. But yeah, I went. I didn't advance time when I spotted, so. Also, we have a pole drifting. I'm going to grab that. I don't care if the strike was done too early. Might just waste the spotting, but it is what it is. 
What's the next tournament on day? Um, catfish, I believe. Yeah, unless they change something, but you never know. Oh, there we go. How's it going, Burgy? Time. This is really rough. <clears throat> oh, did I miss your comment? Oh, I did. I did. I did. Yeah. Uh, no, I thought I had a doctor's appointment today, so I set it up to not do it. And then it turns out I'm feeling a lot better, so no need for it. Jeez, flinging fish across here. Should have brought my ollies, I'm thinking. Oh, you know what? I know what I can do to fix this. Give me a second. Go here, go back in, and we will switch hook sizes, and that will help a lot. There we go. This should be a little better. If I was on peak time, that would help. Yeah, I caught a tiny bit of the yeah the Minecraft stream. Yeah, yeah, we were talking about it on there. Actually, we had a lot of fun on Minecraft yesterday. Got a lot done. Should be using a smaller hook anyway, because I do want to get gobies as well. All right. That looks like it might be a goby on this one. Seems pretty light. Have a good one, Micah. Oh, nope, just a normal zig. Glad you're feeling better? Yes, yeah, so am I. Tell you that. It's not fun staying in the bathroom all day. Also, what comp did I do that I need in my boat? Because I have my good boat out, not the X-Series one. I don't know what comp I did that had that. Tells you how much I've been paying attention. Slunge? Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, I think I did slunge the other day. All right, so we got a couple at least. Acted like you were going off. Oh no, look. 
I'll go off for a while and both you go off. Got that one. I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go. Oh, this might be a Gobi though. Oh, common bleak. I did actually need that one. Okay. Alright, we'll take that. We had silver bream. <sighs> Let's get into the boat, actually. Now it's advanced time so we don't do that dumb crap again. Ian, have you tried that Warships game yet? Yeah, I'm in the back of the belt on that, yeah. Uh, do you like it? It's not too bad, yeah. It's not very deep. There's not a lot. I mean, it's the same thing kind of on repeat, but it's kind of peaceful. Yeah. Yeah, I did have a go on it. Too bad. Have you been playing as uh, Britons? No, I'll go for the better boat, really. Oh, so American. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've been, I've been working on the Americans. I'm going to save all the other ones for later. Because I feel like you have fun restarting each group, you know what I mean? Because you got these different commanders and you know what I mean? You can use, uh, kind of go back down to tier one and start again in, in the Japanese boats or whatever they may be. But I can tell you, uh, yeah, I really do like the American ones. I got a couple other ones, but I'm I'm biased anyway because I love World War II stuff. Anywho, so like uh, besides like the a couple really good classes of ships out there, the Americans actually did have really good naval stuff for sure. Like the Yamamoto from Japan was insane, obviously, and the the Turpids class, the one with the Bismarck in it, that's a sister ship. But that whole class of the Germans is good. There's some really good Great British ships or Great Britain ships out there too. I feel like in that game though, they dumbed down the Americans because a lot of the ships they have listed were never really World War Two ships, you know. Oh, really? No, so when you look at carriers, like when you go for big carriers, how they list everybody else's country, like the Lexington, the Lexington was at the beginning of the war, and they have it as like a tier seven, and then they have these little like cruiser converted ships, like the Langley, yeah. that were never like a real true aircraft carrier. Yeah, I've been playing a lot of that um, Far Cry as well, actually. 
Do you, how do you like that? Yeah, it's just good to shoot people. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So, <laughs> no, it's a big game as well. Like, it's going to take you ages to finish it. Quite nice. There's lots of little side missions and stuff like this. I mean, I, I always was intrigued with that game. The problem I have is the storyline. I'm I like I like games that don't have a storyline. Like, go do go do stuff. Which that game isn't terrible about, but it doesn't. It's not like you're completely dictated by a storyline or nothing. But some guy in the room just caught a sixty-seven pound beluga. Mm. I didn't know they got that small. Mm. That seemed quite small. That's glorified white sturgeon. Oh, Rex playing that of the World War game, is he? Yeah, it's surprising he didn't pop into the party. Oh, see if he's stuck on that now, isn't he? Yeah, yeah, he likes it quite a bit. Well, I think for him it's a change of pace because uh, he's been basically just playing Fish and Planet and Ark for a while now. Yeah. I'm a little different from everybody because I play so many games. You know, I... Yeah. I do videos on like six or seven. I'm trying to narrow it down because, you know, some people don't, not necessarily all about every game, but. All right, have a good one, Ginger. See that, Marty. I'm not sure if I'm doing it or not yet, so I'll see. Have you done Savage Class re re recently, Ian, or no? Nah, no, I actually no. Do you like that one or not, really? Yeah. Yeah, it's like you said, it's moving around different fish. Yeah. yeah. Are you doing it today? I don't know yet, really. Oh, got you. Because that's kind of later for you, ain't it? Oh, uh, really? What time's it now? Half four now. It's only an hour and a half time, so it's not too bad. Oh, okay, yeah. I signed up for it just in case I do it. Oh, oh crap. Freaking. I am. My spotting is terrible today. Mm -hmm. I'm not going to catch any fish if I keep spotting all over the place. Although I will say the midday on the sunny day at Russia, when it's clear like this, and there ain't no fog, it is a really cool looking map. Like, I don't think it gets enough credit for that. I think it's actually myself most underrated map. Just because when you do spot, there is a lot to do here. Oh. When you spot, what's your favorite map? Weeping Willow still? Yeah. Yeah, I have been there for ages. Yeah. yeah, I was actually thinking about going there today, but I was like, I haven't been to Russia either, and I got a lot of fish to catch at Russia. I don't even know how many how many we've caught here. Looks like a couple, but I'm just gonna have a quick smoke, buddy. Alright. I get it, I get it, I'm coming. I 
There we go. We needed that. So we just need a regular silver bream for silver breams. This is actually a good bream spot anyway, so. Hoping to get the blue here as well. Where are you guys all fishing? How's it going, Anastasia? Blue bream. That's a good one. We'll take that. Not a uni, but we needed it. A car, a uni bream on red worms. That's kind of weird. I mean, obviously happens, but. When do you go? You know, I could go at the same time. That's a good roach. Yeah, I'm working on it. Young Bream, got that one. That's actually a good common roach. Caspian? Oh, Rudd. This guy seems pretty small here. Oh, I have mayflies on? Oh, I didn't want mayflies on that. Uh, let's do... Wax worms. Got a PB roach out of number four. I didn't think I'd be getting any big ones. We'll have to see what the size of that one is. Again. Ooh, a, this is a good one. That's a good silver bream. Holy crap. I'm using a. Are you there, uh, Ian? Yeah, yeah. Yep. I'm using yeah. a four hook and I'm catching oversized pretty quick, easily. It's got a PB roach and a three five or a three six silver bream. What? Which, that's not my PB silver bream. I think I got like a four, but. Not sure what this is. Huh, something that went to the surface, that's interesting. Prussian, okay. 36, that's a bunch more. <laughs> 
So you only going for catfish at the Congo right now, or what are you, what are you going for anything? Yeah, just catfish, really, yeah. Just try different bits. Just a very easy fish. I will say, I started fishing uh, Cornish Jack there, and they're a lot of fun. Mm, they do pull, don't they? Yeah. Especially if you use cat boxers. Mm -hmm. We need to switch this pole because I want to get. Let's see here. Obviously, it's probably going to come out. Glad you're getting things sorted out. If uh, no league, I'm going to do some painting at my son's. I'll fall on my phone. Oh, got you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No league today. No league today. There will be next week. I just didn't think I was going to be home for league, so it's on me, guys. That's not, not, not an ounce. Oh, a uni perch. I don't think I've ever caught one of them spotting. To be honest. I don't think I have. Uh, it's going to be total weight. It's already up, actually. It's total weight for... Oh, there's a Caspian. That's a good Caspian, too. Um, that's close to a PB, I think. Yeah, total weight. Anything goes at... Uh, Maku. Trophy rod. Even with the small hooks, spotting at rush is fun. Mm -hmm. Need a, actually a trophy bream, as dumb as that sounds. There's a tench. Can't be anything big. Oh, and the Shut the Hell Up award goes to Dave. <laughs> Uni, blue, uh, Uni Blue. Silver. So we got all the silvers now. So, since you're over in European, why are the young breams so blue looking? Is that the way they are in real life, too? Yeah. So, people, do they confuse blue breams with young breams all the time? They're not really blue as such. But, um, but yeah, they're just little bream, really, yeah. Like gray looking almost? Because obviously the game can't be perfect on everything. But they look. When they come in. I can't tell if it's a blue bream or a young bream until I get it all the way in. Yeah, the bream are horrible in real life. They stink, they're all slimy. Oh, really? They look cool as hell. Oh, yeah. You usually catch I... them you carp, you go carp fishing, you catch them there, and then they just, they snot everything up. Your neck is all snotty and everything, yeah. Horrible. Oh, really? Mm. So, well, I will say, though, the roach might be my favorite fish in the game. I just like the way they look. Mm, they're pretty fish in your life, yeah. Eric says, hey, Dave, got re-catch done on every lake. 
few weeks ago, Vogue Xander here in Gizzard Shed at Blue Crab gave me fits. Yeah, the the Gizzard Sheds, that's a that's a funny one. I've never had issue with Gizzard Shed before. I'm surprised you had a hard time with the Gizzard Shed. I did when I first when I didn't know how to catch it, and then once I made the about the time right before I made the video, I was feeling really good on them. In fact, I think we went to them not too long ago in a league, actually. There we go. All right, now we might even have 40, maybe? 42, all right, that kind of quick. Let's go back to the boat dock here. I think we're going to go to the boat dock and spot again. But we're going to try a little different here. So we have to look and see what we're really missing up here. Oh, look, somebody's using the same thing. Um, could get a uni asp quick. Still need Trophy and Trophy Caspian. Trophy Bream, Carp, that'll be easy. Common Roach, I have a unique but not commoner trophy. Oh, the rough, okay, yeah. Well, I'm really the small hook, so I'm gonna see what happens. Russian. Hmm. Red worms. You know, we need the roach to rut in that, so I think I'm actually going to switch this off. Crickets. What one? Let's see if we can get the asp. Have you? How many lakes have you got done on your catch them all, Ian? I have not clue, actually. What's that? I don't really know, actually, to tell the truth. Oh. I know this Congo one I've done. Um... Oh, you have the Congo one done again. Mm -hmm. Did you have any better luck going the second time with the elephant fish and that? Uh, yeah, they come out really quick, actually, yeah. Oh, really? Yeah. You might have to, while you're down there, send me your favorite spot down there and see if it's changed at all. I think it's the same one, actually. I think near the little island. I think. I think, I think oh, maybe. Yeah. You have to keep in mind that it's been a long time since I did Congo stuff, because... I don't even think if I have cargo stuff, I, I might, I I might only have like the miles and maybe a couple catfish down there to be honest. And Jack hook size, I guess, also seemed every lake always one stubborn fish. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Except for Lone Star, there's no stubborn fish at Lone Star, Leslie. They come out pretty quick, all of them. And Alaska. I've never had issues with Alaska, but this is me. Yeah, there is a lot of times, though, where you have that one. That is too big of a hook size for what I want. Oh, and no wonder why I have that on. Go to the Kraken, and we'll go to... We could actually see where them are sitting on the leaderboard. I don't think many of them are going to show up yet, obviously. So what do we have? Uh, Caspian, 
three five three five three one three one silver bream at two. Oh yeah we got a bigger silver bream than that all right let's see russia been so long i don't even know what the sizes are anymore Oh, it's right, that Sturgeon Leviathan. The Blue Bream is first. That one's already up on the board. I'm surprised any of these are up already. First on the Caspian. Then we had the what was it? The roach. The roach is first too. I knew that one was gonna be good because that actually was my PB. Yeah? See where the bleak is. I don't think the bleak was oversized. Oh, it was oversized. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Shut up, Dave. That was first. But we already got five first. Uh, Rod. I don't have a UD on the road yet. All right, and I don't have a rough, I don't think. Uh, any of these that I catch? A perch, but that's tiny. My perch wasn't oversized. Grudgian, I don't know what my Grudgian was. I think it was just normal. Uh, let's see. don't think we had anything else. Oh, the tench might have been. I don't know. No, okay. Yeah, all right. Perfect. Let's throw some spot out. Be super nice if I actually get this spot out correctly. So, do you ever go to spot for funny anymore? Or not really. Um, not really at the moment, no. I mean, I'm glad I'm doing it now, but I needed a little bit of a break from it from when we were going hard in the paint on it. Yeah. Still need to get you on Ark. <laughs> but I came out with a new mode that I would be fun to have you on. It's uh we don't we normally play PvE nowadays. We don't play PV I don't play much PvP, but they came out with a mode called SOTF. I mean it used to be out on PC a long time ago, like five years ago. It's a survival of the fittest, where it's like a circle closes and you gotta be the last team standing. Last person standing. Um, but considering you can tame dinosaurs and shit, you know. It was a lot of fun before, but they changed it quite a bit, so I want to see what it's like. By the way, didn't get a reward hoping for same some bait coins, but gained nothing but extra markers used. <laughs> Yeah, I hear you there. I actually cleaned out some markers the other day. I think I got a few now. You still play that Conan game, do you? Uh, so I took a break from it because it's pretty broke right now. Like, more broke than Ark. And Ark, Ark is pretty rough. But Ark... Ark has more issues with, like, just the game crashes once in a while. Or, you know, s s stuff that's not crazy end of the world. Whereas Conan is, like, the last time I played it, I was recording an episode for the series. And 
out of nowhere, I just started getting mauled. <laughs> it was an invisible boss, and I didn't see it. <laughs> Which, normally I wouldn't care about, but when you finally get something and it took you, you had to wait 18 hours for it to be in one of them stinking wheels, you know, and then it just gets murdered by something invisible, you lose your, after a few times of that, you're like, eh, maybe not. The interesting thing is, I, if you would have told me eight years ago that the games I'm going to play most are simulators and survival games. I'd be like, you're crazy. Because I literally just raced and did sports games. And, and, the occasional, and the occasional Pokemon game. But now the sports games to me, outside of the new college football coming out, I have zero interest in. Like, none. They just get so repetitive. Mm. Well, Harvey's catfish fight, actually. It's ages to get him in there. Oh, are you on land? Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah more fun that way. Now you, um, you're making me want to go to the Amazon for Paramba. <laughs> So that's a fight. Mm. Well, obviously, a, a, a combo is bigger, but it seems like the prom, prombas are just vicious from land. <laughs> like, you fight it for, like, 20 minutes, and you're like, yes, it's going to be a great unique, and it's, like, 40 pounds. What you what one are you are you going for all of them right now or just yeah I've got the um bamboo it bamboo it's called cool. yeah. why do they why do they not have a catfish tournament down there or a comp oh yeah I've oh, got a couple of comps on there I think um no ruler no party I think it is that's one really like a certain size a certain weight I think it is yeah but like a salmon clash one. You know what I mean? Yeah. Where it's like, get a trophy, you know what I mean? Points or, you know. Because I would love the shit out of that. I'm trying to think if there is, I'm not sure, actually. Tiger's Trail is the same thing for ti the tiger fish. Mm -hmm. yeah. I thought about doing it the other day, but... It, for me, it was really hard to do comps the last time long because, well, two reasons. I'm just doing them for fun, but also when you got to run to the bathroom every 30 seconds and there's no warning, it's not like I can fight a fish and bring it in. It's like, I got to go, you know? <laughs> yeah. There's no winners in that fight. Oh, I better make sure nobody's talking to me in chat. I'm good for that. I'm not watching. Somebody just cut a trophy vote Xander. I I hope for his sake <laughs> that he's not I think I hope he's got the uni. I I hope for his sake he does. And not only that, is a two pound trophy vote Xander. Smallest you can get. Not two point eight, two point oh. Yeah, I'm going to take a break from Volker Xander for a little bit. Yeah, they're not your friends, are they? No, it sucks because they're so cool looking. <laughs> that actually, now that I think about it, that might be my favorite fish. Like the way it looks. Yeah. That or the grayling. Yeah. Graylings are pretty cool. I didn't know they were salmon. Did you know that? I'm in the salmon family, yeah. 
Yeah, I didn't know that they were all, that was salmon. It wasn't until like a month or two ago. They're trying to compensate um, grayling, I think, when you catch one, they smell like cucumber. I think that's true, I think, I'm not sure, but yeah. I've never caught one. I think it's a real one, yeah. It's supposed to smell like cucumber. Why is that? that? No idea. No idea if it's true or not. Oh. See, you guys got some sweaty, smelly fish over there. Yeah. Three is the worst. <laughs> Three is? So is roach bad then, too, or not really? No. Just bream. Bream. Bream are really slimy. Eels are really slimy. Brings the worst fishery. Yo, it's so weird because we have we have both in here apparently, but I've never ever seen one. I seen it on the lake sign a couple weeks ago. I actually went there and there's like there's fish in there that they say they're in there I've never seen before. But I to be honest, I didn't even know we had carp until how long ago? You know, like six oh, yeah. months ago. And we have I mean we have like forty pound carp here. Don't you have to get rid of them or something or not? Mm, no, I don't think so. No, I think I think there was probably a time where that was a thing when they were considered invasive, but now it's just like they're here. I think the only thing they really fight for here against mm -hmm. is like bullheads, you know, or tiny catfish. Otherwise, they're just free food for pikes. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder what happens when a big muskie sees a big carp. Like, I wouldn't surprise me if the the muskie would try to eat it. Yeah, I get it. I'm coming. Jesus. We'll take a big muscle. Yeah. I'm definitely losing at least one of them fish. Oh, another big bream. Three six silver. Xander and Volga remind me of walleye. They look similar. Oh, yeah, yeah. And th they really are. Oh, back-to-back -back silvers. Gotta love W Neeking. Wish that was... Well, I guess I'm spotting, so it's not that big of a deal. I didn't realize Xander get as big as what they do. They get to, like, 40-some pounds. Really? Yeah, I guess. Well, I looked up the world record. It's like 20 kilograms. Did we have... I think we had a Caspian, didn't we? Yeah, we did. We had a big Caspian. That one was not big. Oh, there's John. Actually, kind of surprised I didn't get a big bream yet. Although we are using a four, so. Let's get them both hooked up. Hopefully you don't come off. Come and roach.
This is a uni bream. I don't think it's that big, but it's definitely a uni. Oh no, it's trophy. Wow, that thing was dead weight. We needed that though. I'm happy that that was actually a trophy. That was the last one we needed for them too. And a goby. There we go. So, we at 50? No, not even close. So, we need a trophy Caspian. Regular Roach. Regular Rud. Hmm. Getting down there. You know what the biggest bream you've caught is? Oh, I have no idea. I've had two really close. I caught like a 13-3 here and a 13-3 at Germany. Which 13-3 here at Russia is huge. You need blue. Oh, now I got hiccups. It's only 12 and a half in the biggest one. What was it? Only 12 and a half. Oh, yeah. So I'm guessing you haven't done it on the... Mm. You haven't done the new mix on them yet, then. Because I haven't even done it that much, and I've gotten that. So I'm assuming uh, you will. Unique Rudd, I think I needed that one. Uh, did we go up one? We did. Uh, what was that? 2.8. 2. I don't think that's a very good one, though. 2.8. No, that's not a very good one. Uh, this might be a little guy. Kobe, maybe? Oh, a PB Grudgeon. That is actually really big. 4.9? 4 4.92. 4 Dang. It's almost a half a pound Grudgeon. Oh, yeah, that's definitely going to be number one. Holy cow. All right. Now, let's quickly undo these. 
Oh, you know what, Ian? I didn't even know. I could go look. I forgot we were close to each other in unis. I think Ian's answered the phone now. Where'd you go, Ian? I don't even see you on the board. It must be... Oh, there you are. Huh. So let's go to this. Come on, pull it out. Are we just not doing this game? What's going on here? Oh, I'm completely getting glitched out, ain't I? Dang it, I hate when this happens. There we go. Now get off the dock. Where are you guys all fishing at right now for all you guys watching? I know some of you are at work, but are you guys watching? Or I mean fishing while you are playing? Well, I know John is. He's right next to me. Apparently he's fighting something decent. Only problem with spotting is when you lure a fish near it, it kind of messes it up. We should go over a little bit farther, maybe. All right, for you guys watching, I'm going to end it here because I had some other stuff yet to do today. Um, but I will talk to you guys later. But we get get, get a bunch of that Russia done, so not too mad at all. <laughs>